Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. So my name is Lacey and this is Lace and Camo. This is a video that I recorded almost exactly a year ago today and it's of a sturgeon fishing competition called Monsters on the Croix. It's a 21 hour sturgeon fishing competition on the St. Croix with the border of Minnesota and Wisconsin. So um, that's what this video is and I made a goal that I would post this video within one year of when I made it before the next sturgeon fishing competition. Well, the sturgeon fishing competition this year is tomorrow morning and I'm still kind of working on the video. It's mostly done, but it's a little bit longer than I would normally post. So feel free to skip around if you want, watch all of it, watch some of it. Thanks for checking it out either way. But uh, when I started recording this video, I didn't actually have a YouTube channel, so um, I was still trying to figure out like, how do you record anything, how do you talk to a camera and all that. And so it was just kind of really trying to figure everything out on the water. Uh, I didn't really know my partner either, Louis Benda. I had just met him a couple months before this video and he we were fishing a catfishing competition together. So this was our second tournament, my second tournament ever. So I was really excited about it. Um, when I asked him if I could record, he was really nice about it and was like, yeah, go ahead and I'll record whatever you want. So I kind of just spent 21 hours recording, trying to figure it out. I had a lot of footage and I made this video. So um, also about this video and about, you know, just like this journey. So. When I made this video, I'm still like learning how to sturgeon fish. So um, Lewis is kind of teaching me a lot as we're going. Uh, you can kind of see that in the video, but I didn't really know what I was doing. Lewis is kind of like the, the brains of all of this. I just kind of go along with him and learn as much as I can. So um, I'm still, still trying to figure it out. I actually, like two years ago, I had never caught a sturgeon. I didn't know one person that sturgeon fished and I decided you know, I really want to catch a sturgeon. I have no idea how I'm going to do it, but I'm going to do it. And I was able to go out there and catch one on my own, which was really exciting for me. So since then, I've just kind of been trying to learn as much as I can and get better at it. So, um, so yeah, that's where I'm at. That's where this video is. And it's like after 6 p.m. And I have people coming over tonight for dinner. It's my birthday. So um, I really want to get this video out. So I'm just putting this out there as it is and it's just kind of a memory kind of an experiment of me trying to figure out YouTube um, get to know my partner Lewis and learn how to sturgeon fish so I hope you enjoy watching it the tournament is about to start and we are just looking for some shad for some bait I think it's probably five minutes before the tournament we're gonna get our uh, little code word soon here so just waiting for that. Lewis is doing the driving and the cast net. It's pretty impressive. First fish in the net. That was. So it's about 12.30 and we still haven't caught any shad. There's more people that are coming in the boat launch now. Uh, the tournament has started and yeah, we're just going to keep looking until we find some. Board. There's still one in there. Yeah. How cool is it getting bait at least? Beautiful. See how I'm just gonna sit here and keep throwing? Because look at see how they just keep sitting there. Oh yeah. Holy crap, look at that. It's all shad. Okay now for the Minnesota I need to get a count of all them shad, so you got my back, right? All them up for me. I gotta count them? What do you mean? You gotta, I gotta write down. You gotta document it. 
Oh yeah, when you're using the net. Jackpot catch. That was awesome. Good start. Holy crap. Oh my god. Lewis is getting a, quite a few netfuls of shad. It is looking pretty good right now. We are just about to start fishing. Lewis has literally done all the work so far and it's almost two o'clock. I have done nothing but watch. And uh, yeah, he's hard at work and I'm just kind of watching him and taking it easy and enjoying the show. Big sturgeon sitting right under the boat right now. I'm just sitting there. Are you joking? Lisa, I don't joke. You never joke. I believe like way too many things that you say. I'm always. Look at right there. Look how big he is. He's not even moving. He's just sitting there. <laughs> Looks like he's like 15 feet. Okay, this is what I do every time. Right above the fin somewhere. I try to make the two pieces equal. Okay. And then I always put this on first because I believe these pieces fall off easier. And I hook it somewhere in the middle. And then this one I go right through the eyeballs. Okay. Short, easy, simple, quick. Sturgeon catching the scene right there. Look at that guy. You want to fly by? Big, small. Uh feels small actually oh man first fish yeah, when they get up, yeah, made me they, shaky they like pull them up yep pull them up pull them up pull oh it's up. starting to resist a little more now keep going you don't pull you don't pull okay you don't pull just don't let them i'll get that one in the front yeah okay. it's going under the boat right, oh my god okay yeah, holy nice crap no, just pull real pull. Real, oh real, here it comes Oh my god. Oh, he is. Should I hold it? Put the, put the rope around the rod. Got the rod? Yep. Real, real, real. Oh my gosh, I'm shaking. Oh, pull, pull, pull it real. Come on. Take your big. That's a nice fish. Oh. Keep pulling, pull it hard. They can take a lot. They can take a lot. Oh my gosh, shake it. Hold on, hold on, get in the anchor. Hold on. Pull, pull, pull. Uh. for 20 hours. I'm already tired. Oh, bubbles. Right here. Right here. That's a nice one. Might be our first entry. Oh, you're going to run. going to run. He's going to go. Woo! Woo, first fish. Oh, yeah. Nice. Let's measure him up. You are so close right there. Oh my god, you made it. You freaking made it. Look at that. 49. That's an entry. <laughs> Can I put it in my pants? Oh yeah, I don't care. Okay. Grab, hold this really tight. Because that's gonna that's gonna take the Yeah, there you go. Perfect. So it's 2.55 and I just submitted my first fish and there's two fish on the leaderboard. Um, we're actually getting surrounded by boats so we might move spots, we're not sure yet. But good start to the day, so that's pretty exciting. Oh, easy. <laughs> I thought I opened that but I must not have. I think small sturgeon or channel. Here's another guy coming. You know, he's not a big. Oh, he's pretty big, isn't he? 
Look at lamprey. See a lamprey? Are those marks oh, from where'd lamprey? Where'd the lamprey go? Oh. It's over there. Yeah, from lamprey. Getting smaller. 42, we might have to move. Oh my gosh, it's creepy. Ugh. Hey, let it go. Yes. <laughs> We're just leaving spot number one. Heading to another spot because this one is getting extremely crowded. So we're gonna go somewhere where there aren't a lot of boats now. Netman! Oh, you guys haven't even met each other yet? For like two seconds at the catfishing contest. Oh, yeah. Is that you? Channel cat. Are, are you sure it wasn't you? Forty-five, forty-six. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I'd laugh if it was forty-seven. Right, forty-five. And a half. Forty-six for sure. Forty-five and a half. Forty-five and a half. We'll take. God. <laughs> we get the little ones just go right back like that. Don't forget the clicker. Oh, Lacey. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Lacey's tied up here, hooked up good, she's handling it no problem. Now it's giving her a little bit of a fight. <laughs> giving her a little workout. She's just muscling that thing right in. Nice work. Forty-five, forty-four. Forty-one and a half. Forty-two. Nice fish. You just didn't want to catch the big ones around us, did you? Yeah, well, we don't want you to know our spot. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let us know what you're doing. We'll let you know if we get, uh, we'll, get uh, on them. We'll be getting something somewhere. Are you are you cutting the shad with your left hand? Well, I usually bite it with my teeth. That's, that's, you see. <laughs> the teeth is what I was taught to do. If you use a knife, that's going to cheat. <laughs> Just ran back to the vehicle, got my heater, a um, bunch of layers of clothes, monster drinks. Actually catching a lot of fish out there. Um, but it's getting colder and we are fishing until 9 a.m. Right there. Yeah, looks like it. Looks like at least 48. Oh yeah. 
Looks look pretty nice. See, they smell with this, and then these drag on the bottom, and then once they find something they like to eat, their mouth shoots down, and then they suck it up. He was really messing with you there. It's a tiny off. channel. Channel. It's a channel. Oh, oh nice. Look at that guy. Hey. 32. It's got huge head shakes. Look at the head shakes on that thing. What is it? Nice one, sturgeon. It's all wrapped up. Weird. Is bike. he tagged? No, that's my. Look at. Oh. It's just wrapped up all weird. What do we got? Is it 56 or no? Oh yeah. 55. Oh, I'll take it. Yeah, some hot coffee would be so nice right now. in this tournament and it is 3.39 there is roughly five and a half hours left of the tournament and I just came into the gas station because I need to warm up and get some hot coffee and change my layers around because I am having a hard time uh, keeping warm out there I burnt like some of the Sherpa off of my blanket out there on the heater um, and then I accidentally threw it like in the river um, like I don't even know how that happened and I did the same thing with my brand new waterproof gloves like I got water inside of my waterproof gloves somehow like I don't know it just <laughs> it just happened so I am at the gas station Lewis is still out there in the boat um, so I'm just gonna try to be quick Try to be quick, get changed, get coffee, um, use the restroom, and get back out there. Get a little bit more fishing done. It's really fun out there. Um, it's beautiful. Like, we've seen some shooting stars. There's a ton of ducks out there. Fish jumping. Um, you can see the stars. It's like, like, it's just beautiful. So, really looking forward to going out there. Um, really looking forward to coffee, too. So, I'm going to get changed up and head back out get another fish or two. So we've got less than three hours, like two and a half hours left to go. We were literally not able to stay awake. We we're like nodding off and we thought this was a channel because it took it kind of hard, but it's a 48 inch sturgeon so it qualified for the tournament. Slimy. The sun is finally coming up and it's finally getting a little bit warmer. It was really cold a little while ago. We're, we just went into shore and we are heading back out. There's like two more hours left or something and we're going to make some breakfast and see if we can catch at least one more. Hopefully. I've got two on the board and Lewis has got five. So, looking good. Fresh cooked, warm breakfast. And this is why I fish with Lewis. Look at that, you got a fish on there. Oh, oh. right off. But that's like steaming. Hot. Getting there. Amazing. A little redneck style, but when you're in the boat, that's what you get. Oh, front, 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 
YouTube over here, huh? Oh, the breakfast smells good. I want to get this fish in fast so we can eat. Well, you keep fighting that. I'm going to eat a burrito. There's. <laughs> <laughs> Almost average one an hour if you go by. You got 24. And really, we've only fished for, well, it's only a 21 hour tournament, and we really only fished for sturgeon for, what, two hours after we started. There you go. Only, almost, <laughs> only give it like a little bit. That's a really good idea. I'm really fast. Well, you know, I'm an idea man. Just less than an inch short. Almost, almost another entry. Last fish of the day. Participate. Yes, you do. You have to. Like you have to participate because you're my partner. I'm just. I'm the captain. No. No. Nope. You're the I captain know. and the cook. Nope. It's all you. So the tournament just ended, and we're heading in. Uh, it's been like 21 hours of fishing, and it got really cold. We're tired, but we got. 25, 26? 25 sturgeon. 25 sturgeon and I don't even know how many catfish. We got more catfish than sturgeon, so a lot of those. And um, Lewis has five registered on the board and I have two. So got a couple entries in there, so that's pretty exciting. And yeah, a lot of fish caught. It was a great night and now we're tired. So we're gonna go um, probably head out, head home, and who knows, be back again soon. Thank you guys for watching. Got some waves coming in. <laughs> I don't even know where they came from, honestly. Well, I am done with my tournament now, and I am heading home. Um, it ended up being 22 hours of fishing. So, 22 hours on the river, you guys. We did it. We made it, and it was a blast. We caught uh, we counted 25 sturgeon for sure that we caught and we had one big sturgeon get away. My line broke and it broke my heart. Um, it was kind of slow for some of us out there, but um, you get in the right spot and you get the right bites and it picks up a little bit. Got a little bit chilly, but overall it was a great time out there. Uh, Honestly, it is so nice out and I'm so tired, but all I want to do is go back and fish some more. Like I'm literally considering going home, taking a nap, and then going back to the river. And I know that's absolutely insane, uh, especially because I start the, the work week early tomorrow morning. But all I can think of is getting back out there. It's so much fun, you guys. When you find something that you love this much, just pour your heart into it if you can. Enjoy it. Like, learn, be 
become good at it as much as you can. It is so worth it. It's so much fun. Thank you for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. And if you liked my video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't su subscribed to my channel yet, but you're interested in getting more videos like this, um, I'm just starting this channel. I'm just learning how to video edit, but I am going to be working on getting a lot more things up in the future. So thank you guys for the support. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed. I will see you guys again sometime soon.